Hey everyone, welcome back, Pop Daddy here. And in today's video, I've got two pops for us to look at. We've got the X-Men Cable, and I've got the Unmasked Deadpool, uh, the original one from the Marvel. Uh, right, if we start having a look at Deadpool. Now, I've been umming and ahhing about this one, uh, probably for, I don't know, about the last few months, whether or not to get this one or not. I've got the original one of this, where he's just got his mask on. But I was umming and ahhing about this, and then was out, at the weekends at my local comic book shop uh, store and I had this in there for 15 quid with a pot protector so I thought that's a really good price I thought we're getting and I'm really really, really actually glad I, I did uh, we'll, I'll tell you why in a minute uh, let's have a quick look at the box so you can see here he's got his X-Force outfit on the grey outfit there on the side obviously it shows him in his original uh, red one but I don't think there is a box with the grey outfit on it's all just the uh, the red outfit. You've got some nice Marvel comic art in the background, and then on the back, you've got some of the uh, really cool and hard to find actually uh, pops. I would love to get Doom. I'd love to get Ghost Rider, and I'd love to get that original Logan. Uh, I've got that Deadpool. I might get that Beast. Not sure. He's getting a little bit rare now, and Dark Phoenix, and I've got Silver Surfer as well. So that's that, and there's the side. All right, let's get him out, and I'll show you. Wow, I'm so glad now that I did actually get him. Box there. Come here. Okay. So here he is in his X Force outfit. I don't know too much about X Force. Actually, I don't know anything about him. But uh, yeah, I really like this grey outfit that he's got on. But it's the detailing on the head, as you can see there. So if you've seen the film, you know how scarred up and burnt and everything he is. And I've actually really caught, cool. I've actually got done a really good job on this. Because in the packaging, all you could see from all the photos was just these like lines around his face. I thought, nah, it's not that great. But then actually, when you actually see on the top of his head, all around the sides, you can see where all the scarring and it's gone through his flesh and it's all torn and ripped. Looks really it's for something that looks pretty gross. It actually looks really nice and good. The painting on this is really good. There's no bleed outs from all of these flesh wounds that, that they've got. All, all of the scars around there, nicely painted. Eyes, there's no bleed out on there either. Yeah, the head sculpts. I think it's really good. It's really nice. Uh, onto his body, so yeah, like I said, this is based on the standard body, the original one. So he's just holding his gun and his sword there. Uh, got the X Force logo. I think the original one, as you can see on the box, has got the little Deadpool logo on this one, but it's got his X Force one there. Uh, yeah, the paint job on this is really nice. Uh, there's only one, I think, I think there's one big mistake because you can see there's a big blob of black on his arm there, but. Uh, I have them like that, so he's, he's displayed with all my other Deadpool and Colossus and Wolverine uh, pops, so you're never going to see that. Uh, yeah, the rest of the paint of the gun is good. All of the detail of his straps, his pouches around his leg, the sword is good, there's no bleed out on there at all. So yeah, I'm really pleased, uh, and he's got his little gun uh, on the side there. Yeah, I'm really pleased I've got this pop to go with the others, I think it's a nice, nice addition. All right, so go and move on to cable. Put you there. Okay. Now I don't know anything about cable. My first introduction to cable is going to be when we see him in uh, Deadpool 2, which we're really excited for. Josh Brolin is going to be playing him. I heard so. <laughs> He's the is that, he's the, now the second character to play two characters in the Marvel. The first was Chris Evans, obviously he played Johnny Storm, and now he plays Cap. And now Josh Brolin, obviously Thanos, he plays in Guardians of the Galaxy. And now we hear he's going to be Cable. But yeah, I got Cable. I like the look of this pop. Move you out of the way, yeah, a lot. Uh, but I got this originally to go with Deadpool and the other ones, Colossus. As we know, he's going to be in the new Deadpool film, so it makes a nice display with all of them. But other than that, but I really like the design of this pop. I love the contrast between the white hair and his skin on the head. Uh, I don't know what the, why he's got one white eye and one yellow eye. Uh, I don't know if it's one's mechanical or what. I don't well guess I'm going to find out. Uh, is he scarring on his eye? Don't know, but it looks cool. Again, he's got X's on his outfit. Now, is he part of the X-Men 
as a goodie or is he like a mercenary like Deadpool? I don't know. Uh, we're going to find out, I guess, as well. It looks like he's got a big uh, metal arm, uh, just like Colossus. That looks really nice. Uh, the paint job on that is good. There's no bleed out at all from the silver onto the yellow and the blue. There's good separation there. I love this big gun he's holding. It's massive, isn't it? It's cool. The paint job is good on it. Uh, you've got two. You've got a dark grey and a light grey. Uh, there's no bleed between the two. It looks good. And his outfit, the uh, the blue and the yellow, it stands out really well. Looks good. And the little red X's in there. It's nice. Yeah, it's a good pop. Uh, nice, nice pop to go the rest of my Deadpool ones. So, yeah, so I'm really excited to see him in the film. Uh, yeah, and like I said, it goes really well with the Deadpool ones. If you've been um and in about getting either of these two, I really highly recommend them, especially this one with the head sculpts. It looks really good, and they've gone to quite a lot of detail uh, that you don't actually see in the box. So when it's out of the box, you can appreciate it a lot more. Okay, right, my next video, uh, I'm hoping to get, oh, I'm actually hoping it's getting coming this Friday or the weekend, is all the Spider-Man Homecoming ones. So I'll have them to, to review. But yeah, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Uh, if you like all of my videos, please subscribe, uh, and I'll catch you later. Okay, guys, bye.